Alright, ladies and gentlemen, y'all already know what time it is, man. If you like the video, like the video, subscribe for more daily 2K content, and let's get right into it. NBA 2K21 got a lot of news coming up for y'all today, man. Listen to me and listen to me good. If this is your first time to the channel, like the video, turn on post notifications, and all that, because we're bringing the 2K heat every day of the week. I'm bringing the stuff that's going to help you guys get better, the best bills, the best jump shot, the best ways to do all that. Man, I got all this stuff for y'all, man. Keep it locked to this channel and become one of the one only gym stars what's going on everybody it's your boy jay easy aka fresh from the barbershop bk the people's champ coming to you live with another video i had to bust out the gym stars because i know y'all guys haven't seen that in a while man and y'all been faithful if you have original gym star drop gym star down in the comment section but look we got some stuff going out in these 2K streets, man. We got people getting banned. We got, uh, you, you know, you got uh, Bass Plug dropping some knowledge. Not getting banned, but dropping some real knowledge on us today, man. And uh, Ticino trolling just a tad, man. You know what I'm talking about, man. And uh, last but not least, uh, let's see what else we got up here, man. We got some information for y'all from NBA 2K Lab on where all the NPCs go and hang out. I was going to do a video about that, but hey, it's best for me to just do I might still do the video about that um, because we got all the routes. But, you know, we're going to see what we can do, man. So if you don't do nothing else, like the video. Subscribe for more daily 2K content. 300 likes. We dropping. Um, we, I'm dropping a video where I played a guy. I was walking around the city trying to show y'all where the best places to go were um you know to play like like uh not not comp games but wages and stuff like that i was just showing out a garage hoop places in the city and a dude decided to lock me in so i dropped him off y'all want to see that man 300 likes i'm dropping that and then i'm dropping the jump shot uh that i use in that video and the official build for me so make sure y'all do that man it's literally the best center build where i can do everything and i'm gonna show y'all in that video but i ain't got nothing else to tell y'all man uh except for i'll be back in one second Make it to C25, that's OG status I was told you could be anything, just don't be average Down bad, flat pockets, that shit made me sad Start hustling non-stop, don't plan on breaking that head Alright, so first up, man, we got the man, the myth, the legend, the plug A.K.A. Badgy Plug, man, check it out, man Your boy Badgy Plug was out there He's showing y'all some stuff that y'all may not know about, bro this is a video where he was able to get team takeover in like a couple of shots, bro. It's crazy how this thing works. Look at that. Boom. He's got team takeover in like two shots. That is insane. And it's like when you do stuff the right way, you got the right bass combinations and all that stuff, man. You're able to... This is this is legally glitching the game. Look at this, bro. He got... He, well, he didn't have team takeover. But he shows you right there where you can get it in like two shots. And then later on, look at this right here. Boom. Like, he's going to get this. He already got one shot. Bam. Here we go. Another joint. Dude hits him with a flashy flash. Trays up. Splash down. Look at that. Team takeover. In like two shots. Stuff like this, I like it. In, I mean, I don't I don't know if I like it being in the game, but I'm definitely going to exploit it. I'm definitely going to use it because it's just because of the fact that, yo, legal glitches. I'm all for it, but stuff like the, the other stuff that people put in the game and they they find in the game and and or find around the game that's not in the game, but they force it into the game or exploiting stuff like that, I can't do nothing about that. But something that's actually designed to be that way, and then you 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 use it and exploit it to your own good fortune, hey, I can't I can't get mad at it. So like with the badge glitch and stuff, it sucks. Like it's not designed to be that way. But you're using the exploit that's outside the game when you're doing the uploads, the saves, and stuff like that. I ain't saying I got, I don't care if nobody do it because nobody don't want to come out here and grind badges and stuff like that. But at the same time, you can't get mad if you get caught and stuff like that. But that's a legal glitch. It's it's in the game. It's just like uh with with Heart Crusher. To me, Heart Crusher was a legal glitch, man. It just is what it is. But and they never changed it, so I guess that's how they intended for it to be. I don't know if they're gonna change. They don't know if they're gonna change the uh the flashy pass and how it works with with the badge combination. You gotta go watch the video to see the badge combination that he put in there, man. I just think it's dope, and I'm definitely gonna use it because Brute don't throw nothing but flashy passes. So we're gonna take full advantage of that. It's gonna be crazy, bro. Two shots and you already in team take that. Crazy man, I ain't gonna lie, man. How many do y'all let me know what y'all think? Is that OP? Are you gonna use it? Or are you gonna exploit it and all this stuff? Or you think you're not gonna get a chance? Cause like all the time, it don't. He don't always throw a flashy pass, even though you're trying to throw one and you're not always gonna make the shot. But at the same time, it's like, damn, that might be a little OP with that badge combination. But yo, it is what it is. We'll see. Up next, speaking of badge glitches, 
NBA 2K21 news. My whole timeline is content creators getting banned. Yesterday, 2K went a little, they, they, I can't even say they went crazy with the ban hammer. They just came out and just showed people that, uh, yo, if you're gonna be glitching the game in, in, a, in a way that it wasn't intended to be done, then we we not gonna we not gonna stand for it. And, and what they started doing is just banning people. Now, from what I understand, they even banned flight. Flight said, look, I, I think what it was, they just had something to go through. If you had a certain amount of VC, then they banned you. Flight said he bought his VC. People said they saw him bought it on bought it on stream, and uh, all his stuff was legal. So I think they're gonna unban him. They unbanned a lot of people. They unbanned them one by one by damn one. But what they were saying is, a lot of people were using the VC glitch where you could do it in like two seconds. I think you had to buy, like you already had the game and then you bought the game and then um, and then the game said, well, you already got it. So it didn't it didn't recognize that you had it. Um, well, you already got the game. So because you already had the game, it didn't, um, it didn't charge you for it. And then when it didn't charge you for it, it was like, okay, cool. Um, but you still got the 100K VC that you got with the Mamba Forever Edition or something like, it was something like that, bro. I don't know. It was some type of crazy, crazy glitch they were doing it and people couldn't do it to the tune of like 100 vc or, or, or 200 kvc they did two three million of them joints and then then get rid of the evidence like bro you can't be sitting there with the evidence right there on your account if you're gonna be stupid at least be smart be smart stupid but I, I guess you know if you did it then it is what it is i don't know if these are permanent bans they say some people got console banned the one thing that i don't like about that is with the people that got console banned is this i know that the people that got console banned are going to do some of the most egregious things in the world uh, now. And what I mean by that is they're going to go and sell that console to somebody at an attenuated price. And the person that's getting it is not going to be none the wiser. They're going to get it. They're going to go somewhere. They're going to hook it up. And they're going to be like, yo, my, the console that you sold me ain't working or whatever. And then they're going to be like, hey, it was working when I gave it to you. It came on, blah, blah, blah. I don't know. And you're not going to be able to get online with the console. You done. You can't do anything. It's pretty much a brick when you get console banned. This is something right here that we're going to we're gonna talk about more in, in the thing. Because last night, the 2K, um, the 2K event was great and all of that good stuff. But the fact that people were getting kicked out at the beginning and, and, and stuff like that, that kind of rubs me the wrong way. But it was because you had the clothes on and the clothes weren't changing and you had to play in certain clothes and you were going in with your regular street clothes on and all of that. 2K fixed that um, and, and people are, are, are playing fine right now. And so I got to give them kudos to that because if you're playing fine and um, and they fixed it, they jumped on something quickly, uh, you know, I got to, if I'm going to be on their ass when they don't jump on something quick, I got to I gotta give them kudos when they jump on something quick. So if the West Coast and all the other people are able to play and they just so like 2K ain't got no love for the East Coast. But well, 2K ain't got no love for the East Coast. Well, let it be known then. 2K ain't got love for the, now I'm just joking. But anyway, back to my point. Somebody's gonna have a console. They're gonna, they got console banned. They did something stupid. They got the console banned. The console can't even get on the internet or do none of that stuff now. They're gonna sell that console to somebody and then they're gonna be like, well, it was working when I gave it to you. And then, you know, it, it's gonna be one, it's gonna be a problem. Because if somebody sold me something, knowing that it didn't work, and they were already console banned when they sold it to me, it's going to be a problem. I, it's going to be some taking type stuff, bro. I ain't even going to lie. That's why when you do something like that, if you say, if somebody sell you something at a price like that, bro, and like people really be thinking that's funny. And I seen streamers actually saying, hey, you just, just sell it to somebody else. And then, you know, like, like that's a finesse. That's a finesse that could cost you more than some VC. I promise you that's a finesse that could cost you more than some VC. So just, hey, do whatever you got to do, man. Take that joint back to Walmart or something. And just wait Black Friday telling me it ain't working or something like that and take it back. Do it the right way. You know, send it back through the system. They'll fix it. They'll unban it. Blah, blah, blah. They'll sell it to somebody else. Don't sell that thing to somebody on the street, man. That could get you, that could really get you, like, hurt pretty badly like that. And you know people that, that, that play 2K, y'all, you're not built like that. They claim they built like that. You you know these dudes ain't built like that. I'm, I'm, I'm about, bro, you sit and play 2K all day. You're not built like that. I don't care who you are, but you know it is what it is, bro. Uh, I wouldn't do it. Like, if I did something stupid, just own up to it, deal with it, and just move on. Don't sit there and try to put your put it off on somebody else. That's crazy. All these people out here, the, the reason that we short consoles is because people can't get work. And then the people that used to make the consoles, they can't work. And people can't get work. 
And so people got to get out here and try to scalp the consoles just to be able to make some, make a little money to, to make ends meet. And you're going to take somebody's money that's trying to make ends meet and stuff like, man, come on, man. Yeah, I can't respect you as a man if you do something like that. I understand that people gonna would try to finesse anything. I can't respect you as a man if you do something like that. I'll tell you, it'd be a real, it'd be a real freaking problem if something like that happened. But uh, look, that's why when you buy con buy stuff from people, man, make them hook it up, make them prove to you it works. When I buy computers and stuff from somebody, um, if you buy it from me, I got a whole 110 inverter in my car, and I'm like, yo, you can, you can, I got, and I got a hot spot. Hook it up to the internet. You can play a game of 2K if you want to. Anything. You can test it out, all that stuff. Make them prove to you that it works. Because if they don't, then, you know, maybe that is on you. That's what some people say it is on you. But if they come back and find you, then who is it on then? You see what I'm saying? It is what it is, man. Uh, like I said, y'all let me know what y'all think down in the comment section. Am I right? Am I wrong? Did I just go on some type of rant or something like that? Or am I dead ass right? Because I think I'm right in this situation but these guys as kids man they don't understand real life they think everything's a game and a joke but playing with grown people money ain't no joke bro i'm telling you bro i know let me get off that subject man for before i get tos up next bro they said that uh, on a lighter note they said this is what everybody's looking like right here bro coming out of uh like everybody right now after the band helmet drop bro it's like i just don't get that though you do something wrong and then you want to get mad at the world because you did something wrong and made a bad decision. And you want to pawn that bad decision off on somebody else. You ain't the only one from the hood, God, dog. We just don't all act like <laughs> Bro, that's a, hey, like, we really like, I'm the only one from the hood. I'm from the hood. Bro, bro. Hey, this guy's, hey, this dude right here, Cooper Good Jr., you're probably from the hood too, bro. Like, hey, we forgot how to do this stuff. Anyway, look, bro. Up next. This pro, this pro one bar moving like an elite bar. You absolutely right, bro. That pro one bar is not moving at all, bro. And I don't know what it is. I don't know if we can, if we can uh, get that fixed. If we can get something done about it or whatever. I don't know. But uh, to help you guys out, man, NBA 2K Lab, they did this, man. Here is a quick map of all the NPCs for the challenges, and uh, they just dropped this map, bro. And it's dope. It's just one of them joints where it's like they got the whole map right here and they tell you they got it color coded and then they got the routes that they go i was thinking of making a video about this but they already did it like this is the dopest thing so i'm like shoot i guess i already made a video about it but they already got this man the link to this is going to be down in the description if you need to find somebody this is how you can find them um this is the route they take you you, you run that trace route and you're going to find the person that you're looking for that's what that was something that i was actually talking about i was going to do man um you know as part of my content uh you know i was like if you can't get grow off of this content something wrong man but uh you know and last but not least tacino trolling what a great day and uh Ta tacino <laughs> oh my god if you look at this right here bro you see it it says that uh it says that post hooking got banned and uh he got banned he got banned for doing the glitch or whatever bro look like that's crazy right now but uh he got banned for doing the glitch i guess and uh Tysito just says what a great day what's a great day he's been he's been bad uh, it is what it is you know you, if you know the whole thing with Tysino and post hooking you know that they go back and forth and post hooking be be uh trolling Tysino, always pulling up always throwing hella post hooks always doing all types of stuff man to um to throw wrenches in Tysino and all of his and all of his streaks and stuff and like i said i mean it did look at this bro this is the best center build out there bro. I ain't cap, boy. i'm telling you i'm gonna prove that to y'all in this video i'm putting up today i can do everything i can even dribble and my dribbling was like 25 now it's up now and it's bro it's, it's crazy but uh you know tycino was just saying like what a great day because he always pulling up on him but now post hooking you try to do the wrong thing and now you're banned right I told y'all what's gonna happen if them guards come over, bro. But hey, the bill still sucks though. But um, you know, he said that. And uh, you know, it is what it is, man. Like, hey, he like, yo, it's it's a great day for him because this dude always pulling up on him and all that stuff. But hey, in post hookings, in post hookings uh bio, he says he's a self-admitted clout ch clout chaser. He he got the first thing he says is clout chaser. And, and partner on YouTube and all this stuff, man. I can't believe that people actually rock with that content, though, where he's just trolling people, bro. It's crazy, bro. I don't know, man. I, I'm, I'm, old, I'm an old head. I'm behind the times, man. I'm a man. I'm over 40. Like, you know what I'm saying? I, I don't care, bro. It is what it is. The stuff that a lot of people go through these days and do and find cool, 
I, I just can't get behind that type of stuff, man. But hey, like I said, Beats is working now. Let me know if you was able to play Beats. Was it worth the double uh, rep and all that good stuff? And um, how you enjoying 2K, man? Are we enjoying it except for the stuff that's actually in the part? Like every every game mode is working pretty much pretty well, I think, except for this. So um, except for the actual park is just chopping. And when they get their server optimization, I think we're going to have a pretty good game on our hands. What y'all think, man? Are you happy with being able to do everything? I'm not happy with being able to do everything. I'm happy that my bill can defend everything. And that's what I made it. I, I, and I can do everything on offense, but I can also stop you. I don't even want to stop me in the game. Anyway, I'm going to catch y'all next time, man. I'm about to go take my little boy to get some of this vegan shrimp fried rice. And uh, when I come back, we're going to be streaming Call of Duty with Bree Easy. So get the video to 500 likes. We're streaming Call of Duty with Bree Easy. And I'm going to holler at y'all next time. Until next time. It's your boy, Jay Easy, a.k.a. Fresh from the Barbershop, VK, the People's Champ. God, speak! Well, them dudes crazy doing crazy stuff like that. You sell somebody a console thinking they're going to be a problem, bro. Well, okay, okay, all right. Ooh. It's little niggas online keep taking stabs at us, but I'm too stingy to even give half a fuck. Gosh, baby, gosh, baby.